Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel and uh, well we have a very important security hazard that can happen on some manufacturers motherboards. So it has been actually uh, disclosed that Gigabyte motherboards so Gigabyte is a manufacturer of motherboards that are basically the basics of your own PC um, what happened is that a company called Eclipsium has actually checked the uh, motherboards and of course Gigabyte uses something that most manufacturers don't do which is a backdoor what does that mean they leave a, uh, a, a space open if you want for a connection that leads to gigabyte company being able to update for example your UEFI BIOS uh, in the background without you having to do it so the idea behind it is not malicious the idea behind it is not bad what's happening is that when you have a backdoor that is open and that can be connected to some bad guys will eventually find and use it and this is where Eclipsium um, actually came in. They actually told Gigabyte motherboards that the connection seems to be used by somebody else. So which means there's a possibility that someone somewhere, hackers somewhere, are able to connect and inject malware in your UEFI BIOS without you even knowing about it. So basically what's happening is that uh, Eclipsium told Gigabyte. Gigabyte said that it is um, going to work on updating this to make sure that it, it uh, actually is not the case. 271 models are affected. Now you might say, okay, how do I know if my computer has a Gigabyte um, motherboard on it or not? Well, go to your search in Windows 10 or Windows 11 and simply type system information and here you will see the system name manufacturer model and BIOS information which is going to tell you that the baseboard manufacturer Asus tech computer here this is what you want to know it if here it says gigabyte then you need to make sure because what's going to happen with this is that the baseboard product and version number and all of that is going to be here you need to check it against this list I will post the link to this list it is a PDF document what you do is you search for your model in here and if you have a gigabyte computer and the model is in this list you are part of those that are at risk of getting hacked through the backdoor that gigabyte actually put on its motorboards is there a way to prevent it? Yes. If you go into your UEFI BIOS, uh, and you can go there by using the um, the uh, options when you hold down, or I've shown you how to go to the um, advanced boot options. In the advanced boot options, you will have an option that will give you the possibility to go into your UEFI BIOS. And this will actually um, have many menus what you need to search for in that is something that will actually be called App Center Download and Install. It's a feature in the UEFI BIOS setup on Gigabyte systems. So you can disable this. If it says enable, because they will probably say enabled, say disable, which will prevent that from happening. And to add to security and make sure that malicious changes cannot be done, you should add a password to your BIOS. That password will actually prevent any changes. Without the password, the BIOS cannot be modified in any way. It's a um, little bit more of a hassle, but at least you stay secure. Gigabyte, of course, working on a fix apparently, so that's uh, something. So just be worried that this could be a thing on your PC. Uh, check the description below for this list of gigabyte affected models and hopefully this is um, eventually going to be fixed 
Uh, you know, we talked about bad door, back doors so many times, including, you know, when the government wanted back doors and stuff like that. This is why you don't do back doors. Because some hacker somewhere will eventually find a way to exploit it. So uh, it's always a bad idea. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.